The American Midwestern town, Raccoon City, has been completely decimated due to the T-Virus outbreak that was instigated by the international corporation Umbrella. Claire Redfield, who arrived in Raccoon City to search for her lost brother Chris and a rookie police officer, Leon S. Kennedy, managed to escape from the city. But their ordeal was only a prelude of things to come. Three months later. Your identification number is WKD4496. <sighs> Welcome to your new home. Her name is Claire Redfield. We caught her trespassing in our Paris lab facility 10 days ago. She apparently infiltrated the complex looking for her lost brother, Chris Redfield, one of the surviving members of RPD's famous STARS teams. on. Get out of here. This place is finished. I don't know, it might have been a special forces team. But in any case, this prison's been taken over. Troops have been wiped out. 
What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. But you may as well know, you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. Misunderstanding, but I thought you were another one of those monsters. Shut up! Make one wrong move and I'll shoot. Relax, beautiful. I said I was sorry. My name's Steve. I was a prisoner on this island, and I'm guessing you're not from Umbrella either. No, I'm Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire. Hmm. Nice. I'll remember that. Hey, I heard there's an airport around here. And once I find it, I can finally escape from this crazy island. Well, I'll see ya. Hey, wait up! I don't want you following me, lady. You'll only slow me down. Thank <laughs> you. 
Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box. Chris Redfield. What are you doing here? Chris Redfield. Is he a relative of yours or something? You mean my brother? Ah. Your siblings. Well, it seems your brother is under surveillance by Umbrella. What? I've got to contact Leon and tell him to let my brother know he's being monitored. It's a good thing I have access to an outside connection from here.
Well, that file shows the latitude and longitude of this place. <laughs> Why don't you send your brother the coordinates and ask him to come help? Thanks. I'll do that. Hey, I was just kidding. There's no way he could get here, even if he is your brother. Yes, he can. I'm sure of it. No way. He won't come. You'll just end up disappointed if you rely on others. Believe me, I know! What was that all about? Yeah. <laughs> 
Please deposit any metallic items you have in the security box.
Ah! <laughs> 
I was too close. But I found something, thanks to you. Looks cool, huh? Oh, I need those. Give them to me. You gotta be kidding. I found it, and I'm keeping it. Fine. Let's make a deal. I'll trade you for something fully automatic. See you around, Claire. Adios. Hey, wait! Steve! Dare you interfere with my operation? What are you talking about? You let yourself be captured so you could lead your people to this base. I have no idea what you're babbling about. You don't fool me. I am Alfred Ashford, commander of this base. Oh? You must be one of Umbrella's lower level officers if you're in command of a backwater base like this one. How dare you! The Ashford family is among the world's first and finest. My grandfather is one of the original founders of Umbrella Inc. Now tell me, why have you attacked this installation? Attacked? Shortly after you arrived, my base was attacked. You must have informed your people of its location. I still don't follow you. I really don't know anything about that. Unacceptable! How can you deny it? My base has been destroyed. 
and thanks to you, the experimental T-Virus was released, creating countless zombies and monsters. Tell me, who do you work for? Who sent you? <laughs> Have it your way, then. You're just a rat in a cage anyway. I'll be sure to keep you entertained before I dispose of you. Thank <laughs> you. 